Let's do another one. Sixteen. Uh, I always open one no if I'm in range with a five card major. Boring vanilla auction here. All right, got a heart lead. So there's not a whole lot to plan this in anymore. Knock out the spade. So once we knock out the spade, it's good to plan anyway. We have four, we'll probably have four spades, assuming they split. Four spades, five hearts, two clubs, and a diamond. That's 11 tricks. And uh, our 12th trick, I mean, maybe something funky will happen in clubs. Anyway, if it happens, it happens. Did I miscount the tricks? Oh, I, I miscounted the tricks. Five plus four plus two plus one. Yeah, pitching those two. All right, here we have 13. Some strange people might make a takeout double here. This is pretty normal one heart over call. Can't really do anything over one though. Yeah, doubling would have worked out pretty well. You got a heart lead. Hmm. Pretty unusual lead. In my experience, when they lead a heart, they usually have short hearts and are just afraid to lead anything. Okay, maybe not. Hmm. So uh, we're a little scared about these clubs and it's pretty obvious that when they get in that they should probably play clubs. So uh, trying anything in the diamond suit seems misguided. Let's just play this hand pretty in a pretty straightforward way. It was offside. So they played club club. So um, if clubs are four four, they have a good club. Kind of hoping that they just. Pitch something favorable for us at this point. Didn't happen. We're not going to take any more tricks. All right. Um, so here we have a good hand, and I'm pretty sure it's good enough here to bid four spades. Three spades would be non-forcing. Here we have a 14 count, 15, but not really 14 with a single then hurt. So let's make the bid that shows that. Um, they did not negotiate a club rough if they could have, if they uh, had one available to them. But the hand's not over. If trumps are 3 2, it's over. But if trumps are 4 1, we have a small issue. So if trumps are 4-1, they're, they're probably going to be 4-1 this way. And if they are, we're going to rough, we're going to try to rough a diamond in the dummy. So we should pitch a club. Okay, they split. So can I do anything better than conceding the ace-king of clubs? 
Well, possibly. If diamond split and somebody has a singleton club on her, that person is going to be unplayed. So let's just see if that happens. They did not split. So Okay. 19, pretty good spots, but it's still not worth an upgrade. Just bit her hand pretty normally. Huh. So if diamonds break, we're looking very good. <clears throat> if they don't, we need a backup plan. But there's no downside, or there's no upside in playing a suit other than diamonds now, so let's just see if they break. Seven to the eight. I mean, we could be sneaky here and play clubs first. Hope they just try something. Hmm. All right, let's see. Let's see what the diamond situation is. Okay, they break. So if we play our diamonds now, we're going to pitch two hearts and uh, try a spade finesse. I think. Um, if we don't, we can try clubs now and just see what happens. Maybe they'll play clubs for us, which is pretty good. Uh, if they switch to hearts, it's not so bad. Playing club now is pretty reasonable. So we'll do, go ahead and do that. All right, they played clubs for us, but they did not take the ace king. Let's see what they pitch. Spade. Spade, a heart, and a club so far. Two spades on this side. With them being high low, this guy pitched two hearts. This guy pitched a club. Well, I'm not going to take a spade finesse, I think. That seems a bit risky. But maybe. I mean, maybe it's okay. Because if we take a spade finesse, they pitched a club, and we started with six. So there's only. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, I don't think it's on side, but it's pretty safe to take a spade for this. No, what do you know? I still really haven't figured out how Gibbs signals. Looks like we would have done well to get the game, but we took uh, the maximum number of tricks. Sometimes that's all you can do. I'm kind of tempted to make a penalty double here. Second choice would just to be to bid my heart suit. I like this more. Show my suit. Okay, well, we could maybe make a takeout double here if it was takeout, but it's penalty apparently. So it is what it is. They invited in spades. That's fine with us. So we do have a lot, ton of defense. We got the deuce of hearts lead. So it's one or three. Probably three. No, it's four. All right. And they pitch the queen of diamonds. Interesting. Um, We could cover here. We don't have to. It's not like he's going to run the nine. But why not? I don't really see any upside to 
playing anything but the Queen of Hearts here. I mean, it definitely appears like he has three diamonds and no hearts. No reason to play the king there. If he had the ten, you would not have been playing this way. Okay. Kind of lost trump control there. No alternative to a takeout double here, so let's just make one. Um, I would say in general, uh, my I mean, we're going to double here, but my observation is that Gib tends to have it. And I'm pretty scared if it goes all pass, but we have no alternative here. We have to double. Okay. Um, Mildly surprised to not be doubled. This contract is basically no shot. We have to lose two spade tricks to make this, which is uh, impossible. Not to mention the diamond suit. So I'm just looking at these spots, put six and five. Okay. So anyway, it doesn't really matter. We're going to play a spade. So it looks like it was a ace jack third here. Looks like diamonds are definitely not splitting and that there is nothing we can do about it because he's counted out as having seven hearts two spades and uh, four clubs so it looks like he had a diamond void pretty consistent with this pitch i mean uh there's nothing to do about it give him his diamond give him his spade Down two seems okay. It looks like four hearts was probably a very easy make. Yeah, five hearts was an easy make. This is weak. So we have nothing to say. In my experience, Gib is ten, tends to be a little bit heavy for his weak three club bid. Queen of diamonds lead out. See if we uh, can cash four of them. I'm just going to cash the ace of clubs here just in case he can rough this and pitch some clubs, although I'm not sure what shape he would have if he, for him to be able to do that. But there's no downside. Okay. All right, we can just kind of concede here. He obviously has the rest. Strong no trump. Eight of clubs lead. So we have four clubs unless it's singleton, in which case we have only three. Can't do anything about it. We have a double heart finesse position and we have a spade, tenuous spade stopper, but it is a trick. So my reaction here is to see what's going on in clubs. We know it's not jack fourth here because the eight isn't consistent from any jack fourth lead. Let's just see how many of these we can cash.
Um, we could make him make another pitch, but I'm a little bit concerned about an entry issue because we're probably going to take this double finesse. So I'm just going to play this now. The Jack of Diamonds. So if it's Jack and one, he just created a finessing. Well, the, the, finesse, yeah, the finessing position was always there. But if, it's, if he has the 10, we can just win it in hand and play a diamond to the eight. What do we know about the hand? We know that he led a short club suit. Unlikely then to have short diamonds. So I think this is a good play. All right, so now just make sure our entries don't get tangled up here. Oh, so let's uh, finish the diamond. And uh, so now just take another hard finesse. Catch the diamond while we're in hand, and we're going to have to give up one at the end. All right. So sort of a not a great tournament. A little over 60. Let's look at our bad boards. This board seemed like it was mostly lost in the bidding. Um, just, it was just a good fit. I don't really blame... I mean, I think this person bid very normally, this robot, I should say. Uh, everything else is just kind of like middling results from playing normal bridge. That was fine. Yeah, not an action-packed set of hands. All right. I think I'm done for now, but thanks for watching.